Hi, welcome to our daily tune-up today. Today we're going to talk about visualization and what is visualization. Many of you wrote in and wanted to know specifically how to visualize correctly. Well, there's really no correct way to visualize. What we're really doing when we visualize something is simply thinking about it. Take this for example. Think of seeing a dog. Seeing a dog walking down the street. Now, if you have your eyes closed, you might imagine some kind of a dog walking down the street. But if I add an element to it, make the dog purple, you're going to have to go to your creative complex to make that dog purple. But you can still kind of think about that. That's all visualization is. There's no right or wrong way to do it. Many people think when someone visualizes, they have to see it like a cinematography uh, motion picture or they have to see it just like looking at a photo album. That's not what visualization is. Visualization is nothing more than a complex of thoughts put together to have a certain meaning. We call that a complex equivalency. But really, you just call it visualization. So think about what you want today. Just imagine seeing the day work out the way you want it to. See pictures of it. See yourself looking at certain things. And if you can't see that, just imagine or pretend what that would be like. Or you might even hear somebody talking to you or saying something to you. That's visualization. That's all there is to it. And the keener you can get at understanding that and doing that in a very quiet space, focusing on what you want and either seeing it, hearing it, or feeling it, or a complex of all of those things, that's visualization. I urge you to practice it a lot. It's an extremely powerful modality to use to imprint brain cells. Keep in mind, your subconscious mind believes everything you say. Once you start visualizing or thinking about something, it starts actually making brain cells imprinted with those thoughts. The more of those thoughts you have, the more you create a habit, a way of life, a way of being, a way of thinking. So make sure the thoughts you think are what you want to be thinking. Make sure those visualizations, as we call them, are what you want in the world rather than what you don't want. The brain doesn't know any difference. It's just going to imprint what you think about. So practice and let me know how you're doing. Until next time, this is Dr. Gary wishing you a very good day. Bye-bye.